Greetings and welcome back to Realms of Magic. I'm Catherine of Sky and there's some, been some exciting news. So we're going to hop to this window here and the devs have released an update and there are some very, very exciting changes coming up in early February. Magic is coming to Realms of Magic at last. There's a new signpost system where we can sort of warp from place to place, new food recipes, um, new and improved guidebook, the map is gonna expand, all kinds of things. And of course, the fire talent tree in Magic. Oh my God, this is so exciting. And um, the most requested feature, locations will regenerate if not visited for a certain period of time. That means that uh, assist player made structures will be there, but all creatures and plants will respawn. I think that is awesome um, because, you know, that will keep the maps renewable and we can keep going to different places and not have to remember, okay, well, we, we killed all the creatures in such an area and whatever. So I'm really excited about that. So last time in, uh, in my game here, we, uh, wow, we just farmed all the ore we could. So this time I would love to go ahead and um, get all this stuff organized. I'm going to take, uh, you know, take everything from that chest. And somebody um, made a comment that apparently I've been missing some of the gold. So thank you very much for that. I, I am, I definitely look for the stuff in the box and I haven't been looking for any amounts of gold, but I really should do. So anyway, we're going to try to smelt things today and get all that sorted. So get silver, craft bars, and let's get our professions window up as well. Get all the iron we can and just kind of craft uh, until we can maybe make some new items, new objects. And oh, we're almost level 40. Yes, steel. What do we need for steel? Okay, let's cancel this craft. We need iron and coal to make steel. Oh, we need, oh wait, we need two iron bars to make steel. So let's see. How much? Wow, we get a ton of experience points for that. Look at that. That's very tasty. Okay, that's cool. I can I can handle that. I wonder if we're gonna get. Well, we need to <laughs> we need to make stuff out of iron first. Let's just make iron out of our iron first, and then we'll maybe make steel after that. But we have a lot of stuff to smelt here, and um, I think the first thing we need to do is finish our. I think we need to finish our bronze sets. We've got copper leg plates, copper sabatons, and copper breastplate, which we all need to convert that to bronze, if only just to get the um, the experience points to you know get us to some some nice higher armor. But I really would like to. Uh, we still have this weekend to collect Santa hats, and uh, that's going to be cool because I, I could use some more bells for the house uh, to decorate things quite nicely, and uh, I'm excited about that. So we're going to go to different places. I have been advised um, by one of the developers to go to. There's a tower I need to go to um, because otherwise I might have too strong of an armor. <laughs> so. We want to have a little bit of challenge there, um, so we'll, we'll get to, oh, look what we got, we got gold, fantastic. All right, let's cancel this, let's make gold, let's do the gold, craft, 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 we're ready for it, boom, level 52, yo, 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 oh, nice, and we even have an even number of gold, life is better, life is cool and awesome, yeah, we need this speed to speed up, 75% speed here. Wow, we are getting really short on coal, I have to say. Uh, we might want to start smelting some of our tin. Uh, let's just do that. So we have a little bit of each so we can get some bronze bars made. I really am going to have to hunt this coal down, aren't I? Really going to have to prioritize that whenever I go mining. Okay, so let's see about... Do I, do I need coal to make stuffs? Like if I make bronze stuff, no, I don't need coal for this. Okay, that's fine. So let's make our bronze bars. Oh, no coal. Oh dear. All right, all right. We have issues now. Okay, let's just shove all this stuff into here. And uh, hopefully get that going on good. Wow, we have, we have materials, guys. This is great. Yay. I'm excited about that. All right, so 
we have no bronze. <laughs> but this gives us a good opportunity to go and collect stuff um, because we probably should. Um, right, clay stuff. What is this? Onions. Oh, onion seeds. All right, tasty, nice. Let's see, onions go in here. We go there. Clumps of uh, grass go there. I am really, really excited. Uh, whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, we we just got a. I meant to do this. There we go. Uh, I'm really excited about the magic system. I'm kind of thinking like, well, maybe I should. Um, uh, what do you call it? Like save up some points, but this is like you know a month away, so I don't think I'm gonna save up my points. I'm gonna be trying to be normal about the whole thing and just like be relaxed. But I'm sure we'll get plenty of um, of points as we're going along uh, and uh, working out and playing the game. Oopsies, fangs are in here. All right, I'm just gonna put my onion seeds out here. Oh, look, we got some tomatoes, how pretty. Okay, we're gonna put the onions in there. Okay, look at these, that looks nice. Oh, we got a tomato seed too. Oh, okay. I will put the tomato seed in here in the box and we'll plant it later. That's nice. We're starting to really get our farming level up to where we're every now and again getting some, some really good stuff. And I can't wait for more of those recipes. Now, um, in the, um, uh, whatchamacallit, the, uh, the, the update plans, it says that uh, some of the veggie recipes are going to be stamina type uh, refill things, and then the sweet recipes are going to be for mana, and I guess the meat ones are going to be more for health, which is a really cool way of dividing stuff up like that. I like that idea. Okay, so, um, hmm, is that all we need to do? All right, we're just, oh yes, I forgot to put my dark elf bed out here. I'm so thrilled about this. I'm going to be able to Let's take this this very boring sleeping bedroll out of there. And we'll put this beautiful dark elf bed. Look at how fancy that looks. Isn't that lovely? Fantastic. Can I actually sleep in there? No, I guess I can't. No, oh, we don't want to take it up. Nope, nope, nope. Three Santa hats here. Doing well. Got our bedroll back in here just in case we want to go to a place. And uh, let's go and find this tower that we need to go to. Um, we also have a quest and talk to Bumrack in hard soil bulwark. Uh, where is that? We might go there first, actually. There it is. It is a sort of temple looking place. There's the tower. <laughs> Fire hall tower. It sounds slightly dangerous. Just saying. <laughs> We'll go there after. Okay, we'll go to both places maybe if we have enough time, um, but we'll see. Okay, here we go. Get out our stick of doom, our sword to kill things. Ha ha, yes. All right, take all. Oopsies, I forgot to do remove. I love the remove feature. Thank you so much, devs. Woohoo. <laughs> so handy, so handy. Oh my God, did you see that rabbit? So scared it was jumping backwards. <laughs> Oh boy, I didn't mean to scare you, rabbit. I apologize. It's so bad to be scared before the doom. Oh my gosh, seems to be a trend now. I really wish I knew what those, oh, I got a seed for blueberry bushes. Excellent, excellent. I need a seed for old berry bushes. So I can, cause that's a, a component of, um, of some kind of, uh, of the higher level health potions. I really need to, to buff my health potioning uh, stuff as well, making, because I'm woefully behind on that profession, I have to say. Okay. So wait, what am I here to do again? I'm supposed to talk to Bumrack, right? Just talk to him, All right? We'll see what he wants. Try to see what we can do for him. Maybe he just wants a recipe for rat on a stick. Who knows? But yeah, I'm excited about the signpost system. That means, well, as, as far as I've read it anyway, it seems to indicate that we'll be able to put a signpost like somewhere within the town or something. 
and we'll just be able to zoom uh, right there, kind of teleport there instead of entering from the side of the screen, which is going to save a lot of time. I mean, in a way, it's kind of cool to have um, just kind of like walk into town, but it does take a lot of time. <laughs> so uh, that's going to be kind of a cool thing. And you can have it either way you want, um, because that's the way uh, the game's designed. You can you can do it either way. You don't have to use it if you don't want to. Uh, so anyway, that's pretty neat. All right, let's um, find Bumrack. Where the heck is he? I don't know. Let's go. Come on. Whoa. Right. He lives at the bottom of this hole. Yo, Bumrack, this is like an antlion den. What are you doing down here? But you don't have any matters to attend? I look at these statues. Those are so good. They are like, like dwarves. Here's Tork. I'm Tork, the entrance guardian. Many trespassers have tasted my axe. Where am I? You are at the hard soil bulwark, a dwarf miner's outpost. I want to earn some money. I doubt we could we would ever hire someone to do our job. However, that's not up to me to decide. Ask Bumrak, our lord. You find him at the bottom of this mine. Okay. Oh, I think there might be a, uh, um, uh, a person making weapons here. Look at this. I love this furniture. It's fantastic. Um, okay, he's got stuff. Oh, clay stairs. I don't think I've seen those. Here's Zibrat. It's cozy in here, isn't it? Yes, it is. Anything else I can pilfer from you? <laughs> Not really. Okay. I love this, like, really friendly style of stuff. This is great. Are you selling stuff? Oh, this is a well? Dig at. Get out of my sight. There's nothing more solid than a rock. You are very friendly, aren't you, dude? Okay. There's a bed here. Dwarven cupboard. Imperial barrel. Those are quite decorative, I have to say. Look at all these books and shelves and things. Oh, we have Nebrin. They're probably all dead by now. Uh, okay. That's a bit negative, but you might have your reasons for thinking so. Hello. You are Virtog. I failed him. I should have gone with them. Something bad went on, looks like it. Okay, nothing there. Um, Rolgon. There's nothing we can do now. Okay, guys, can, can you tell me what's going on? Maybe I can help with this situation. Okay, wow, look at this fireplace. I like that um, central design. Small moha sack. Nice. You know, that's exactly what I expect a mohair sack to look like. Very nice. Dwarven mirror. Burlap sack. Okay. Okay. Here's Bumrack, finally. Here's a guy with a very red beard. Um, and he's got like a braided beard. Lovely. Okay, who are you? I'm Bumrack Sharprock. I'm the ruler of this outpost. Uh, who are you again? the same thing. Okay. What happened to this tunnel? Why do you need any help? Don't be nosy fellow. That's dwarf business and you have nothing to do with it. I just wanted to help you. That's all. <sighs> I'm sorry, stranger. I didn't want to sound rude. It's just this burden I carry on my back, which makes me very edgy. Why is this tunnel sealed? This outpost was made because of the ores in the ground. The richness we found quickly increased our appetite for more. Soon after, greed overwhelmed us and we went down, down, and down this rock. Zagmig was the most gold-lusting of, of us all. He wanted to be the first one to get deeper, and so without my permission, he took his most trusted dwarves and dug further. What happened next? When there was no answer from them for days, I started to get worried. I sent my scouts to find out what happened, but they never came back. However, on the third day of Zagmig's departure, one of his comrades got out of the tunnel. We were happy to see him, but it quickly turned out we were wrong in our judgments. This dwarf's mind was taken by madness and bloodlust. He managed to kill two of us before we put him down. Wow. 
So you collapse the tunnels so the others wouldn't come back and slay you all. That's right, stranger. It was the only way to be sure. However, I'm dying to know what happened down there. Therefore, I have a job for you. You may dig through the tunnel and explore the mines beneath. If Zagmig is still alive, question him on what happened. If he's out of his mind, end his life quickly. The same goes for all crazy dwarves you encounter. They are my kin no longer. Afterwards, if you get from this alive, I expect you here. What do you say? I'll do it. Jeez, this is really rough. Go with haste and bring me news. I'll reward you greatly. Okay, I have to go. I talked to Bumrack from Hard Soil Bulwark. It was a sad conversation. Okay, so I guess that is the quest completion. So, right, we got to find out uh, what happened here. Okay, so this is, is that food? No, it's tailoring. Okay. Nothing else we can take, right? <laughs> I'm so bad. I'm like looking through all their stuff. This is Jinrak. We won't forget them, he says. Okay, woolen sack, oaken crate. Okay, let's uh, go down carefully. All right, so I have learned we can usually dig out this silty stuff. All right, let's get out our sword again, just in case. I hate the likes of you, all right. Check one floor at a time. We know there's someone below. You're a disgrace to your kin, boy. All right, boom, nice stuff. Ah, yes. Oh, look at this, that's, oh, that's salt. I got excited, I thought it might be silver. All right, we're good. All right, let's go down. Be careful. <gasps> cut you to pieces right he has <clears throat> he's got an axe holy wow he's he's dangerous oh where oh my god okay 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 I have an, an issue at the moment which is that I think I'm, I have the wrong food on me. And I have, um, yeah, this is not great. All right, let's put the right food on. Shoot, I should have had that on so I could start building up the HP buff. Okay, so this is a regular healing potion, which I really don't want to use because it restores 100 HP. Let's use this one as our secondary. Oh boy, this is going to be painful. <laughs> this is going to be really painful. Uh-huh. Whoopsies. Okay. Oh boy, this is just hurdy, hurdy, hurdy. Oh boy. Oh. Yeah. That was not good. <laughs> Yeah, that was hurdy. That was really hurdy. Oh, my Christmas tree! Oh, it bloomed. I mean, it, it grew up. Yay! It's so pretty. Look how pretty the, the flames are going. Okay, so, um, that was bad. That was really, really, really bad. I have, uh, I don't have any of my potions on me at the moment. I have very little food. I think I'm gonna take some food and, um, <laughs> okay, buff quality 3.5, 4.2, 5.7, 6, 6.2. I think we'll take a charred wolf steak. How about that? We'll leave this one here. 2.5, this is 2.6. Okay. 
put that one like down there just to oh it's the same thing whoops okay great um yeah we'll do that this is just not great not great man Ugh. okay and i i should have known better i should have um tied myself to a spawn point in the dungeon which i did not do well that's cool Oh, oh, whoops. Not that cool because it takes so much stamina. <laughs> whoops. Okay, it'll be fine though. Okay, we gotta get some. Just like jog. Jogging, man. Jog. There we go. I love having those upgrades though. Um, I was just thinking about that. It's, it is very overpowered to have this thing, but on the other hand, I had to spend a lot of points to get this. Um, you know, the stamina regen plus the, um, the reduction in cost for the, um, the stuff. So it is, it is very powerful, but you have to spend a lot of points to get to that state. Okay. We can get there. We're going to be fine. We're going to get some guys, some dwarf guys bed, grip it for our own. And we shall respawn here. Let's go down here to uh, probably Bumrack's bed. Okay, right. I am very grateful <laughs> that we still have our weapon and our shield. This is just a mess, isn't it? Um, I will suffer much, I have no doubt at the moment about that. God, no, that was not good. Oh dear. if I can stay out of combat and regen. You've never experienced such suffering as you will now. I probably should have made some, um, <laughs> some, some potions at home. Okay. So now I am gaining. I wonder if he's gaining also. May Sivdra give me strength. Yeah. Oh, guess. Yes, he is. Oh, no, there's a second one. Oh, no. Yeah, this is not ideal. Let's get our torch out. Can I take all? Right. Okay, that's how we'll do this. And uh, we're gonna get our potion to where we need it to be. Where did that other large potion go? I do not see it. It's the sort of triangular shaped flask. Okay, that's fine. Now then, I have this. Oh, he has it. How nice. Come on, come on. Oh, this is just, this is a nightmare. This is so bad. <laughs> this is not a happy time. No, 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 definitely not a happy time. Oh no, I died again. Shoot. Oh. I am very much beginning to wish that I, uh, 
I have I had more stuff on me. Okay, I need my this stuff right there. Give me my Santa hats, you you bad guys. died again? What? No, 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 no. No. <laughs> this is so miserable. No. Oh my god, and I'm eating these wolf steaks apparently like crazy. Uh, that's not great either. Crows will consume your remains. Great. drink. Keep on drinking. Oh. <laughs> this is so miserable. Roll, roll. Oh my god, roll the wrong way, wrong way. Oh, I have no no stamina. That's the wrong, what happened there. Okay, stamina, stamina. Great. This is certainly not ideal. This is really not ideal. Oh my goodness. Oh man, that was bad. Kill, kill, go kill this guy, please. Oh man, okay. Nope, don't kill me. Oh shoot, that was so bad. No. Come on, come on, come on. We can do it. Kill this guy. Oh boy, oh boy. <laughs> that was so bad. Oh my god, that was so absolutely miserable. Oh man. Oh. <laughs> this is so sad. Okay, so I I am not thrilled with this. Um I felt that was very very poor performance from my part, but it's hard hard these these mad dwarves uh, where is our torch bit of a rock here uh, looks like we have some dangerous stuff people down here as well let the slaughter begin <laughs> oh my god he looks comically scary in that Santa hat plus bright red beard oh wow this is just I need a grenade this is what I need I need an I absolutely need a grenade here for this situation um, they have six to eight this is just horrible this is really really scary especially since I can't like hurt more than one at once. Oh God. Okay. Can I, can he come up here? Oh yeah. Yeah, he can. He can. Whoopsies. Whoopsies. Come this way. Come, come on. Come on guy. Okay. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, run, 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 run. Can. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right. Um, Oh jeez. 
I'm really running out of these uh, <laughs> these things. Nope. Oh darn it. Nope. Oh darn. Well, that was awful. Okay, okay. This is just not great. Okay, now we got him. Now we got him. Okay, when he's running off, that's when we can really get him. Whew, this is just bad. I really need to go home and make some more potions. I didn't think this area would be that dangerous and difficult. Okay, there's my, my cat is meowing at me. <laughs> okay, well, okay, all right, Mad Dwarf, Mad Dwarf, no. Can you come up here, Mad Dwarf? How you doing? Nobody will recognize your corpse when I'm done. How we doing over here? Coming up here, one guy at a time, please. Hello. Okay, there we go, another mad dwarf. These are just really, really bad. Boy. really need that ability to to like the dog the roll will reduce a hundred percent of the damage I think that would be really useful okay I need this I really need buff here help buff okay and maybe now that I know you can like charge up this attack even when you're like not you know what let's let's look at the attacks let's look at the attacks real quick um is it talents yeah talents all right okay what is this power attack damage from 170 150 to 175 to 200 to 225 what is this Uppercut, quickly press and hold mouse button after releasing power attack to perform uppercut. So that's kind of like what they're doing to me, I think. Okay, decrease in stamina. This is uppercut damage. All right, what is this now? This is speed, right? And then when we got power attack charges faster. Okay, and then attack is quick, excuse me, quicker. Um, that sounds pretty good. Spin. I want to do a spin. But spin is very far <laughs> along this tree. Um, what is this? Decrease power attack stamina cost. I think we're going to go with the power attack gives much better damage to 225%. We'll apply that. Okay, let's see about, okay, increase the speed. We want to get to the spin. I think we want to do spin because I'm hoping, I'm not sure if it will, but I'm just hoping maybe it will give us the ability to hurt more than one crazy dwarf at a time. I hope. Come on, mad dwarf. Okay. Okay, that's just not great. Okay, let's keep on going. Oh no, he's running away. No, you cheat. Okay, <laughs> this is really dangerous. Because there could be any number of guys out here. Okay, 
Out, out, out. Okay, out. Okay. Oh my god. I didn't know if it got it. I had the autosave happen. Oh my goodness. Okay, there is stuff here. Take all gold bars. Nice. Gold uh, ores as well. Oopsies. Yeah, the, the faster attack would be, or faster wind up to this attack would be most useful. Yeah, don't kill me. I've just tried to kill you. Really? Mm hmm. Take all. Take all. Okay, got that. <sighs> yeah, this, uh, huh. it's not great. Take all. Whoops. Remove. Spawn point set. Okay, so we still have some room to keep on collecting stuff, but man, we are so short on potions. And there are two guys down here. Yeah, I don't think we could survive this. I think what I need to do, I need to get out of here. I need to definitely go back home and make some potions. So I think that's what I'm gonna do. Uh, let me just do that real quick and I'll be right back. All right, I decided to just show the crafting of this stuff because it could be kind of interesting. We have, um, I think I wanna make the lesser healing potion. Uh, because we are uh, kind of needing it at this point. So we're going to need Burdacus and Old Berry. So we're going to prioritize this. And if, if we have any extra Burdacus left, we can make it into the minor healing potions. Um, so we need uh, Alchemy Vial of Water. We need one of each of these ingredients. So we need, um, let's see what we're limited by. We're, we have 37 Old Berry. So that's what we're going to be limited by. Um, and then let's just get all of the vials that we need for all of this. And we'll get also these small vials as well. Okay. I think I'm going to put away some of these other potions that we're not needing. Uh, like stamina potions and things. Oh, I forgot to put these guys away as well. Uh, I had uh, <laughs> just put a lot of things away, but I didn't uh, need all of them there. Uh, so we're going to go and grab some, I think the glass, is it in here? No, it's in this box here, I think. There's our glass. So we'll go and collect that. And we have eight of these vials, looks like it. And we're going to need 37 altogether. So we want to make some of these. I think it's in here. Not sure. Or is it in the smelter? It might be in the smelter. Okay, let's see. And we also have some bronze bars, I think. Um, copper, bronze, yeah. <laughs> I feel like I should be stronger when I go back there. Um, yeah, bronze leg plates. We're going to need regular leather and linen rope, so we can pick those up as well. Um, linen cloth, linen rope, and let's get our leather out. Perfect. Okay. Okay. So we're going to make all the things we're going to make. We need 30, what do we say? 37 of these vials. Okay. Alchemy vial. Uh, let's get calculator 37 minus eight, um, is 29. Sounds great to me. Um, did he, did he, no, we don't want, uh, we definitely don't want that many. Okay. It's okay. Oh, shoot. Two X. Okay. That's fine. We got it exactly then. So we have 38 of those, which is just fine because we couldn't have made it any less. Um, all right. And we'll go <laughs> get a little bit of armor because it's scary. Oh, this is so scary. All right. Bronze leg plates, please. Yes. Yes, we want, um, we need bronze breastplate. Yes. Craft. Boom. 
and the other thing is bronze sabatons which we are out of bars no um do we have did we get any coal we have oh we have coal okay so we need we need tin bars here we have some tin bars and copper bars and how many do we need for that for the bronze sabatons we need five or four bronze bars for those so let's make four craft boom smelting has increased i am happy good bronze sabatons let's go yo kaboom the shoes are mine Okay, we now have a full set of bronze armor. Can we make an iron pickaxe? Yeah, we'll make that. All right, let's get our iron bars in here now. I'm ready for it. Craft. An iron shovel. Please let me make some iron hatchet. That's fine too. Iron hammer, that's fine too. Not that I really care about an iron hammer, but can we build an iron mace? Finally, yes. I'll take an iron mace, eight to 11, a little bit extra damage. Okay, because before we had seven to 11, the bronze sword. I might keep this sword because this has served us quite well all this time um is that all we can do really iron hatchet tins hoe iron hoe i don't really care about the iron hoe iron hat right now we're gonna need solid leather and woolen rope okay let's go first of all i want to put some of these items in the cart for selling so we'll sell these things. Okay, these gonna go back in there. Let's get our costumes sorted out. Um, where did I have my bronze stuff? Or copper? Copper, there we go. Copper leg things, copper. Okay, got stuff a little bit out of order. That's not too big of a deal. I'll even put the sword over here. Why not? Um, and that should be just fine. We'll put this. We need solid leather, right? Or was it this one? Hard leather. I don't remember. I need a woolen rope, though. I have the wrong rope on me. This is linen. So let's make sure that we have uh, wool. And this is what? That's linen rope. Right. We don't, do we have any woolen rope? I don't think so. Okay, let's go and process some of that then. Okay, great. Let's get our woolen rope. Let's make, I don't know how much we need, like maybe 20 or 30. All right, there's, I'm just kind of watching the number on the left there. One more. Okay, there we go. Boom. Okay. Let's see what we can make now. Okay. <laughs> this is kind of scary. <laughs> but it's going to be fine. We're going to be fine. All right. Now it's going to be good. Iron pauldrons. Every little bit. So these are what? These have armor 40. These have armor 50. Those guys were wrecking me. I was really not doing well there. So I'm happy to get this going. We really need these new items, iron leg plates. I'm so happy to have better armor. I'm just excited about it. I'm going to have to replace all those things. Let's see. Anything else? Iron breastplate. There we go. These use a lot less, it seems like a lot less um, leather and rope, but I'm not quite sure. Maybe not. Maybe it's the same. Okay. Um, Hey, iron, 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 iron. We have changed our outfit. Wow, we're looking pretty snazzy here. Um, great. What's next? 
Steel pickaxe. Right. I can have that. Thank you. Yes, we'll have that. Oh, uh, whoops, not that. Uh, I wanted the crate, please. Steel bar. Uh, I probably could improve this whole situation. We need our iron bar there. Make some more steel. We're gonna need more coal. We have, this is just basically what we picked up on our journey today. Uh, but at least we can get a better pickaxe. Uh, it's kind of interesting the way, you know, you have to make, well, you're encouraged to make unless you make a whole bunch of other random candelabras. <laughs> you could just decorate your house, I suppose. Uh, let's craft this. Boom. Okay, that's fine. But uh, we do know that these, you know, they do help us in our work. They have a better crafting incidence. So steel hatchet, there we go. Craft one of those. Um, so that's good. And then steel hammer craft. Good, good, good. And I will not craft the hoe because I feel like that's a waste. Definitely a waste. Can I have some kind of steel mace? Uh, yeah, I have just enough. The meow is real here. Check that out. Okay, we are going to be powerful peoples very shortly. So now we went from 7 to 10 to 9 to 13. So I am quite well pleased with this situation. And now we have steel helmets, but we have nowhere near the materials for this. I don't think we even have much moha. Um, though we should probably, I should probably figure out how much we need of this rope um, so I don't over make it. Um, but we have some leather, which is good, and uh, we'll be able to make that soon. But for now, um, all the crafting, we have no more time left in this episode, unfortunately. Um, so thank you so very much for joining me. We're going to go back to that, um, that, that bulwark and try to kill those crazy dwarves um, and, uh, and see where we get to. Uh, and of course, <laughs> we're going to make those potions too, because I've completely forgotten about that in our armor upgrades. But we do have the potions and we're going to get to that very shortly. So thank you so very much for joining me. Take care of yourselves and each other, and I'll see you next time.